Well, I'm Muriel Lord, and we are in the southwest corner of Boland. And this stream, which you can hear, is uh, here. It's called the Burnslack Brook. It's a good place here to see some different rocks exposed along the succession in the Carboniferous. Of, uh, quite a bituminous smell to it, but it doesn't last long. I haven't met Quidrilla staff yet, or anybody from the oil industry looking around. But you have to be wary. You need to think ahead a bit, really. You know, it, it's going to change our countryside tremendously. And you just wonder if Lancashire is just going to be sacrificed. Well, they're going to leave something behind, aren't they? They're going to leave a well dug. And it's only man-made. It's, it's only made of cement. Cement isn't a thing that lasts. And it, it, if they've got these deep wells that have been used for two or three years and then they go away or they drill another one, we're going to be riddled with possible fault and problems forever. And there's no way we can go down there and sort them out. Who, who is going to do it? My own personal concerns is that if we have the licensing extended across here then anywhere in this district uh, there could be pads and they could be looking for it because the shale is here and if they're doing horizontal drilling along a sweet layer where there is this bituminous smell this bituminous layer um, we could get some exploring and development up in this region i think we do have to be looking ahead we have to be thoughtful about this and each area has to know their own patch and the farmers have to really be aware of what's going to happen in their region they'd be drilling underneath and their springs might be poisoned how would you know until you had a problem and and how can you put it right i mean this is for future generations to think about there's power in the people if you all get together and work together really keep on top of it and gather as much information as you can from other groups who've already been impacted. They are the experts, the people who've already suffered this. Because it's all new, completely new type of industry. From where the holy springs run clear, down on the foul coast sir, the drilling rigs are setting up, there's nothing they don't dare. Where greed and money mingle in, and taint our precious source, and left are we with Satan's soup, not fit for sheep nor horse. <laughs>